Welcome back to Whisper Gaming ASMR. If you're new here, I want to let you know that I record and upload two versions of all my videos. One with quiet gameplay audio and one without. So if you'd prefer to watch the other version, it is linked at the top of the video description below. But today, we are back in a new retro game on my ROG Ally. We're playing another Nintendo 64 game set in the world of Pokemon. I never played this game, or I wasn't really aware of it until recently when I was going through Nintendo 64 ROMs. But it's called Pokemon Puzzle League. And it had pretty good reviews, so I thought I'd give it a try. People had suggested that I play a puzzle game. I don't think this is what they had in mind, but a puzzle game and Pokemon seems like a pretty good combo. So, let's see if this will work. Oh, I need to go to gamepad mode. Okay. I think it'll be pretty simple to figure out, but... I'm just not sure these bumper buttons work correctly. But I guess we'll see. Move the cursor. Select play mode. Start. Cancel selection. Scroll blocks up and down. Okay. Well. Um, I think it's a basic. Like, match three type game. Let's begin by using the control pad. Blocks are switched by pushing either the A button or B button. That's all there is to switching blocks. Simple. Okay. With an empty space can cause higher blocks to drop. Blocks are cleared by putting three of the same color. Okay, pretty basic. Okay, here I go. Even he's holding a Nintendo 64 controller. Okay, I think I get the basics. The entire stack can be raised by pushing either the L button or the R button. Don't raise it too high once the blocks reach the ceiling. The game is over. Now that you know the basics, we can learn more advanced techniques, combos, and chains. So their difficulty chains and combos will score you higher points. To score a combo, clear more than three blocks at once. Let's give it a try. Okay, can I back out of this? I think I think I understand how it works. Way to go. I bet that gets tiring hearing Ash saying that over and over. My stomach is making growling noises this morning. Okay, I get it. I get it. Oh, can we just move on? I want to do it myself. 
Well, I think that's enough teaching for today. Next time, I will teach you more gameplay techniques. Okay, well, let's just see if I can do it myself. Options, one player game. easy. Yeah, not sure how far this works, but I don't want to go through like another hour-long tutorial. Why would he pick crappy? Okay, let's see if I can figure this out. It's a hard game to do commentary for because I'm so focused on the puzzles. getting any of this hard stuff. Am I missing one? There's got to be something I'm missing. Oh, crap, 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 crap. That's the easy level. Maybe I should have watched all the tutorials. how many people actually played this back in the day. If you played Pokemon Puzzle League actually on N64, let me know in the comments, because I had never, had never heard of this game. It was not on my radar at all. I 
I can do pretty decent until they start dropping those long blocks across. Sucks. a combo is that how I send those things over to screw him over?
Yes. Who is the easy level Pokemon Puzzle Master? Wow, Misty is not doing well. Oh my gosh, you're gonna lose already. right. Oh no. He's about to 
send over another block, I think. Am I about to beat this guy? Now who's the baby, Lieutenant Sarge? Good night.